begin this noon with that breaking news. Thousands of flight delays and cancellations right now across the U.S. This here's a live look at Newark Liberty International Airport. A major computer outage forced the FAA to order a ground stop for all departing aircrafts. The FAA is working to restore what is known as NOTAM, the Notice to Air Mission System. The ripple effect is being felt nationwide, including at airports in Chicago, Dallas, Virginia, and Pennsylvania. It also affects the major airports in our area. Eyewitness News reporter Anthony Johnson is at Newark Liberty International this noon. Anthony. Hey, Joe, we're talking about plenty of frustration this morning from airline passengers. A lot of that frustration continuing at this hour. Last count, 7,000 flights all across the country have been delayed. Another 1,000 flights were canceled. The terminal here at Newark Liberty Airport has finally started to empty out as airline passengers wait for later departures or deal with cancellations. It got delayed till 9, 9.30, and then finally it got canceled, and now we're just waiting for my parents to come get us. So The Federal Aviation Administration had to order a ground halt around 7.30 this morning because of a computer problem, and planes were lined up on the tarmac waiting for it to be resolved, but there was a domino effect. We were supposed to be taking off at 9 o'clock this morning, and as of right now, we're still waiting on the plane to get here from Atlanta. That we're not going to be taking off now until almost 2 o'clock. Newscaptor 7 was over LaGuardia as our John Del Giorno described the computer meltdown and why the system known as NOTAM is so important to air travel. Those are notice to air missions. That computer provides information that is necessary for pilots to file flight plans to go from airport to airport. That information can contain safety briefings, local notices, but the information is necessary for those flight plans. The impact rippled through the nation's airlines, which are slowly playing catch up to get people to their destinations. This had the biggest impact on domestic flights. Well, I'm heading back to college and my flight was supposed to take off at 10 o'clock, but it's now delayed till 1150. So just sitting here waiting. Yeah, hopefully a lot of the folks that have been sitting here waiting will finally be able to get on an airplane this afternoon. The system started working around 9 o'clock. That's when they were able to restart NOTAM. And the president has told the Secretary of Transportation to investigate this matter to make sure that the NOTAM system was not hacked.